Hey guys, it's Scott from Let's Play Easy Mode, and today we're going to be diving back into the world of Gears of War 3. In easy mode, let your worries disappear, it doesn't matter who you are, all are welcome here, come and take a load off, leave the world outside. In easy mode, sit back, kick back, cast your cares aside. Let's escape and play. Hey guys, welcome to Let's Play Easy Mode. If this is your first time here, then welcome to the channel. And if you're one of our regulars, then welcome back. Today, we are going to be picking things back up with our playthrough of Gears of War 3. Now, the last time we played this, honestly, it was a very emotionally charged episode as we lost Dom, one of the two main characters of the franchise. Um, which really led me to answer some of my own questions and, and just kind of, you know, I've kind of wondered if the third Gears of War would really be kind of the end of the, the, the story arc, uh, at least in, originally intended. I mean, it, by losing Dom, this seemed like a pretty big one, uh, which kind of led me to think, okay, we're probably wrapping up the story as far as Marcus and Dom go. Uh, but it was actually quite an ending for Dom. Dom gave his life up saving Marcus and the crew. Um, you know, he also had his moment to kind of make peace with Maria, at least, you know, he was at a, a memorial, um, you know, where he left his necklace there and was kind of like, I need to stick around a little bit longer and save Marcus, you know, and keep Marcus alive. Well, that's exactly what he did. He only stayed around for just like five more minutes in the game and we lost Dom. And so I, I got kind of sad from that. And it was interesting that you guys also shared with me in the comments that I'm not the only one. Uh, this was a very emotionally charged moment in the game series for most Gears of War fans. And uh, man, if, if this is what's happening halfway through the game, I can't even imagine what we're gonna see for the second half, which is what we're getting ready to start right now as we get ready to start act four. Uh, there's six acts in this game and we're getting ready to start act four and I have no idea where we're going from here, but I'm excited to go on this ride with you guys. If you're excited, do me a favor, drop a like on this video. Also make sure to subscribe for more content. Uh, come hang out with us at Discord. And if you'd like to support what you see, uh, then make sure to hop on over and get signed up at Patreon, which you can do that by going to this link right here. You can get your hands on all kinds of extra goodies by signing up over there, like free merchandise and early release content and exclusive content. A lot of stuff to be had over there over at Patreon. Special thanks going out to our current list of patrons, guys. Thank you so much for your continued support. If you're out there and you would like to join this amazing list of people, then make sure to hop on over and get signed up today. All right, guys, without further ado, let's pick things back up with Gears of War 3. Okay, we are getting ready to get back into the world here, and uh, we're starting in Act 4, uh, Ashes to Ashes. So we just lost Dom, and uh, we're going to go ahead and pick things up. Today I'm drinking uh, Madrinas Cold Brew. This is the caramel flavor, which is actually my favorite one so far. It's kind of tied between caramel and mocha. Those are my two favorites, but so far I haven't had a dud. I'm going to do a little cold brew today. Mm. And uh, I've done their hot coffee. I really enjoy that as well. Cold brew, there's just something about it in the summertime, right? And it's really enjoyable during uh, during gaming. You can pick this up for yourself. Um, now, I am not officially partnered or endorsed with Madrinas. They're just one of my favorites. And uh, there's a link down in the description below that if you click that referral link, that will give you $10 off an order of $30 or more. And, uh, and it also helps the channel as well. So uh, make sure to check it out. If you would like to have Madrinas for your gaming fuel with whatever game you're playing and you wanna stay up late at night and play, you know, Gears of War or whatever it might be, and uh, enjoy some caramel, you know, Madrinas or whatever flavor you want, uh, make sure to check that out. Mm. Uh, I definitely recommend it for sure. All right, let's go ahead and pick this up. That's it. We're out of gas. There's Dizzy. Whoa, so this is Char. Damn. And people still live here after the hammer strikes? Yep, they're in there, son. Hmm. But they ain't the welcoming kind. <laughs> Dizzy's an old seasoned vet. We're out of choices. We need the fuel, welcome or not. Mm. We've got to get to the shipyard. 
You can Does hear that emotion still, Marcus. Marcus has lost a big piece of himself. For sure. Okay. You can quit tiptoeing around me. He's dead. But he saved us. So we'll make sure he didn't die for nothing. Hmm. Man, I mean, that... The relationship between Marcus and Dom is deeper than just saying best friends, you know? I mean, these two are just connected. How are we looking? All right. Here we go. I didn't even get a little pop-up graphic that time with my reload. Ooh. Oh, oh they're people. Yeah. Ugh. It's kind of creepy. It's oh. like this is what they were doing when the hammer strikes hit. It's all that's left of them. Ash. Man, look at them. They were running for their lives. <sighs> and they've lasted all these years. Yeah. It's a mass grave, people. <sighs> Let's show what respect we can. That... It's the child. Oh, that gets me. Uh, if, if you're new to the channel and you don't know... Uh, oh, another child. I am... Uh, I'm a girl dad. My daughter is nine. And uh, I'm a stay-at-home girl dad. So I've been spending the last nine years of my life caretaking for that kid every day. And um, homeschooling as well. Uh, seasons of homeschool and... Uh, so usually anytime I see tragedy in a movie or in a game with children uh, always gets me a little deep, you know. Um, that one always plucks a nerve. Oh man, these people. Wow. Whew, this game hits. This game hits. Oh, you can see it's like almost like a memorial. They've put some flowers around those people. My gosh. Okay, this way. Whew. There's something different now about Marcus. You know, he's lost Dom. And, uh... It makes me wonder if Marcus is going to give himself up. Dizzy. There's nobody around so far. Nobody alive, anyway. Dizzy, you're breaking up. Damn, lost him again. Okay. We better assume someone's got us in their sights. Mm. Actually, I know Marcus. The, I, I did see... I didn't really see much, but I did see a picture of him older, which I don't think was just like a fan-made picture. I think it is from a future game. Man. Whew. Can you imagine if you actually had to walk in a world like this? How haunting would that be to actually see people, they're dead, but they're like forever caught in their last moment you know just it's like a it's like time froze very very haunting very well done in this game but very haunting it requires caramel madrinas to cope with you know celebrate with madrinas cope with madrinas there's some more ammo Okay, I hear something. We're gonna be getting ourselves into something here in a second, I think. Look out! Oh! Piano. Well, we can't say Dizzy didn't warn us. Hello, anyone there? Hey, we just want to trade. Guess not. Okay. Stay sharp. 
and watch out for more accidents. I thought the floor was going to open up underneath us there. Ooh. All right. Hey, stop! Oh! They've rigged the whole place with traps. He took off left, around the corner. Follow that. Don't lose him. Catch Ash, man. We better keep an eye on the Ash people. He could be any one of them. Oh gosh, that's freaky. They they can they've got it so they blend in. That's something new. Wow. Does that mean they can? Oh my gosh. That is so creepy. Ooh. Whoever had this idea had a brilliant idea for the game, but man, this would be uh, really creepy in a movie. I mean, it's really creepy now. I wonder if our gun would highlight red if it was actually a target. Oh. Again, the the little kid stuff. Ooh. No telling. And the music matches it too, for sure. Really good music score. You know what? Man, this guy must be cross-eyed. Fall back! It's it? another trap. My gosh, this is messed up. So we have a sniper. I, oh, I forgot I got the scorcher. Now, where did that act go? Ah, oh, don't worry. He'll show up again. <laughs> Ran into that. Oh, good lord! Look, that guy's out of his damn mind. I mean, how the hell does he even get him in there? A box of polyps? What the... Yeah. Pretty messed up. Okay, there's our door. See anybody, any snipers up here? Let's take a look in here. Okay, let's do it. like a I don't know there's it's scary and this is kind of distracting from what you know the loss but there is still a sense of loss in the air I think there's an ominous you know um, kind of just tone about things hey hey God, you hear that oh. look out oh my gosh oh my god 
gosh. Amateur, you think you can scare us off, huh? We're gears. Okay, quit talking trash. Save your breath, Jace. Come on. All right, all right. Sorry, Marcus. Solemn, that's a word I wanted to say. There's a solemn feel, especially within the energy of Marcus. You know, you've got something. There's no wisecracks about the darkness of this level. What the hell? We better check that out. But oh, carefully. Gosh. After everything I just told you. No, 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 not the babies. Nope, nope. Oh gosh! Now you see that sh there? That? That ain't funny. And there's the recorder. <sighs> Man. Oh! him up there? Hey! I'll tell you what. When I get my hands on this guy. Right there. Oof. This poor person was crawl looks like they were crawling out of their car to get away. Oh wow. So that must have been the direction. You can see the way the buildings are leaning. So the bomb, there was a bomb that came from this direction and the force blew everybody in this direction. Cause like this person has their hands up and you can see the way the buildings are leaning. A lot of attention to detail. Disturbing and sad, but a lot of attention to detail. Gosh. Okay. I'm really glad your health regenerates in this. Imagine if you had to keep adding health in this game. That would definitely add a whole new level of difficulty. Oh! You can do that? I'm just now figuring this out. Could have traded weapons. Family right there. Oh, gosh. It's real, this game's really cozy. You think anyone's home? Picking nerves for me. Hey, hold your fire! Damn it, we're gears. Oh, they can hear me. I said, hold your fire, you... You dot, 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 dot. Oh, boy. I don't like the sound of that. Nope. Oh, go. gosh. Oh, yeah, sure. Now you can hear me. Ooh, we got a big one. Maybe they'll notice that we're good guys? You got one 
chance. Don't piss me off. Griffin don't want no outsiders in this town, especially Cog. You took a big risk coming here. Look, all we want is fuel, and then we'll go. Is this Griffin willing to trade? Well, lady, he might want to do business with you. Yep. Just take us to see him, little man. Now. Yep. Exactly. Great Don't mess with Marcus right now. Cog. You can see the mess he made of the city. The folks around here haven't forgotten the hammer strikes. Listen, we just saved you from the glowies. We're still fighting and dying out there. Whoa! Sorry, lady. Just explaining how folks feel. Hey, tell me about Griffin. Oh, he's the chief around here. Griffin and Molson Corporation, remember? Yeah, so you've got fuel. Hmm. Well, not since our last shipment went missing. So you're not much use to us then, are you? <laughs> Just find us some fuel and we'll be out of here. Okay, okay. But let me sweet talk the chief first. These guys aren't as big as the cogs, but they definitely have their share you of no business being here, Cog. Their share of weapons. Hey, hey, can you show me the two piece again? All right, one last time. Awesome. I like oh got a chicken. A chicken survived. Um I like how this one really also touches a little bit more, I think, on life outside of the cogs. Kind of the, the world state that everything is in. Yeah, only crazy guys move around on the ground. Yeah, we noticed. Nah, it's the damn cog. Yeah, yeah, can we come in? Why are you bringing them up here? Talk at practice for the chief. Come on, man. They ain't ordinary cog. Hmm. They just killed a heap of glowies for us. They really need to see the chief. Yes, please. You are hopeless. But only cause it's gonna be fun watching him kick seven I guess I'll have to step the sun off. Weasel. <laughs> okay. You know, I think I heard a griffin. People used to say he's badass with the hate for the coalition. It's quite a little facility they have here. I wonder if they'll open this up to us. Is this maybe you cog aren't all bad? Take what you need. Oh, thanks. Oh, okay. A boom shot? Ooh. Yeah, torque bow. You guys know I love the torque bow. Don't try anything stupid. You don't try anything stupid. There, I told him. Did you hear that? Shut him right down. <laughs> Look, there's his office. Marcus. You can tell because there's a giant G on the front of the door. Mr. Griffin, sir. These car guys showed up and they did a great job on the glowies. Now they want some fuel. What the f are you doing bringing the cog here into my city? He looks they, they, almost they, they like they a cog. He's glowies, big. Sir, they, they just want some fuel. Boy, get out of here before I lose my patience. So welcome to Griffin Tower, cog. It was here before you destroyed Char and it's still standing now. And so am I. Got some nerve coming around here asking for favors. Sir, we understand. We just need fuel, and then we'll go. You don't understand. 
You seen those ash remains? Those were my workforce, my employees, my family. I don't like their rest being disturbed by outsiders, and especially no f ah. Oh, I think we understand grieving. Oh, and who the f are you? Marcus Phoenix. Hmm. It is a name I think I recall. You know the first rule of business, Mr. Phoenix? Remind me. It's what's in it for me. You need fuel, so do I. Ironic scene is how I built an empire on it. So you get my fuel back, and I'll let your punk ass keep some. Well, what's stopping you from getting it? Our refinery across the way is a little late with fuel shipment. They didn't even send my cable car back. So I'm asking you to progress the order for me. Get my fuel and my cable car. Now, can you manage that, killer? Yep. You wouldn't be setting us up now, would you? Now, get, damn it, get your hands off me! Marcus! They jumped me and took the truck! They, ah, wow. Every contract has a performance guarantee, Phoenix. Your associate is now mine. Don't you lay a finger on him. Don't you f dare. You got an hour. Don't waste it. Let's go, Marcus. Yeah, I feel like Marcus is either going to break down or become a ticking time bomb. I kind of wanted to see Marcus like Hulk out and just explode here. Yeah, let's. Nice of them to leave all these supplies lying around. Okay. Okay, so we need to go get that fuel. He had a group that haven't come back yet, so they're probably having some problems. Okay. Let's do this. There's Griffin's other tower. Yeah. Certainly did a thorough job here. I've never seen a city trash this bad. Damn, it must have been hard to push that button. It was. I was there. It's okay. Okay. Well, we're gonna probably have to blast our way through. Here we go again. Good. I need to kill something ugly. Hey! Heads up! The stops are back! Stay sharp! He's a could come out of anywhere! name of the game with this game is uh, Duck and Cover. Guys, explore. Fire in the hole! Wow. Okay. Hey. Now you piece of Come on, this way. Head for the Is there top. more ammo? No or was? Let's grab this. I'd say we go back and grab him if we didn't need the fuel so badly. Man. 
I lost that ammo. That was more like a, a ploy. Hammer burst. I don't want hammer burst. I like my gun I got now. There's the group. Over here. There's some guns lying around. Probably all hammer burst though. Retro Lancer. I love it when you can get a quick, quick uh, reload. Ooh, which way? Let's take a look down here. They've cut us off. Coming. Now we need hammer burst. Gotcha. Ooh. So much for that. Leave these graves alone. This actually works really well. This. Hammer burst it is. Oh goodness, okay. Here we go. Here we go. This whole place is unstable. Go. Oh gosh. Did 
That was really freaky earlier when we saw the guy who blended in with the, the dusty people. Well, I guess we're not going back that way. Yep, point of no return. Look, I think we're following the old subway. Oh no, not again. <laughs> he said the same thing. This one's been tricky. Well, we managed to reach the tower Stay in one Stay away. Piece. And there's the cable car at the top. Now all we have to do is get up there. Okay. up again. Right, I gotta get out of that spot. That is not a good spot to be in. Ryan. All right, let's get inside. Cheers. Ammo. This will do. Lovely. Um. Okay, let's let's um. Take a look. I'm gonna see if there's any more hammer burst. Yep, there we go. <clears throat> I know it's not place cold train. Deserted. You know, maybe they abandoned the place and just moved somewhere safer. Maybe. Perfect. Plenty of elevators and no power. Let's see if there's a generator. Or else we got a long climb ahead. I like the detail of him putting his hand up when he sees the fire. It's those little details that matter to me in games. I love that. Lovely. Where am I going? 
Find a way to power up the lobby. Okay, there's the power switch over there. Lovely. Uh, finally, something goes right. Yeah, but then it always goes wrong again. Okay, let's go and try Fair. one of the lifts. Well, here's hoping it's intact. Uh, anyone else hear that? Wow! It's not just mercy then. Well, that explains why the ship that never came back. Oh shoot! That looks like where we need to go. Hey, thanks for the assist, whoever that was. All right, let's get to that cable car and go get dizzy. So yep. I guess we're taking the stairs. Oh, and there's still some ammo here. That's good. the counterweight. Let's move it. So, if they've turned Lambent here in the refinery, you know, it really does look like the emotion's the cause. But hold on, we, we've been exposed to emotion too. Not as much as they were. They refined the stuff here. No wonder Griffin stayed. Oh! Saw them in Hanover, only not that close. Gunka. Yeah, let's not do that again. Ever. Yeah, get me off this lift. Okay, let's get to the cable car. I hope they haven't trashed it. There's some more ammo. Let's keep going. 
I think it's a we're in chapter three of it now? Can't tell. The cargo's intact. Well that's something. Come on, let's get out of here. You know one thing I want to do real quickly? If you will humor me just for a moment. I want to... What is the difference here? I've been wanting to... Okay, view controller. So, when you... Oh, click to cover crouch. Aim and click to mark target. Okay, I was wondering what in the world this left stick does. Because part of me was thinking of changing it over to like a running button because you know so many games you click in the left stick to run it's not moving oh, looks like it's secured to the building with a safety cable then let's get in there and cut this thing loose There you go. Still being a gentleman, letting the ladies in. Was there something I wanted over here? Uh, yep. Let's see what this is. It's like a grenade of some sort, or? Yeah, I'm all set. I like my frag grenade. Yeah, bust that up. There we go. Guys are really getting it. Good thing we got uh, such an able crew. Come on, come on. Keep going. That cable has to be secured around here somewhere. So many of them. And they never stop. I thought that was more Lambent for a minute. Look, there's the cable. All right, let's cut it loose. A mulcher. Mount this heavy weapon on cover. Um, uh, okay. That did it! Good to go! Come on! Let's get out of here! Okay. 
pretty cool. I like that you can still stand and shoot with it too if you want to do like a hip shot. Okay. are open. You're the one who keeps running in and blood in my way. Not of a girl. Oh shoot! <laughs> Slow crawl with this thing. But it gets the job done and it saves using our other ammo too, which I like. Here I am. Sorry to keep you waiting. Okay. Okay, we're done here. Let's go before those things catch up with us. Marcus, come here. This is Dizzy. What the? Did he escape? Dizzy, go ahead. We're on our way back with the fuel. He better hold off. Queen Mira just showed up with her war beetle. Oh. We see her, Diz. Just keep down and head to the roof. That b definitely following us. Hey, the queen's pulling out. Then let's get over there and help Dizzy. Dizzy. Let's go get Dizzy. Okay, we're clear. Now let's hope Griffin keeps his word. Dizzy might turn into the, Bloody well better. the new Dom. Hope Dizzy can hold off the queen's guards until we get there. He survived worse, like Scourge. But if anything happens to him, Griffin won't be so f***ing lucky. Hey, Marcus, it's a long way down. He's gonna hold. We'll stand a better chance without those barges. Look out! I guess you can only get those things down with, uh... Because I... I've blown those up before. They're probably only with bigger guns.
Oh no. We can't lose Dizzy. Marcus can't handle another one. Which, oh, good, 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 good. Coming, gang, coming. She wanted in on that action. Use the ladders! Come on! We got to get the dizzy! Come on. Let's go, let's go! We're coming, Dizzy, we're coming! Marcus, we're pinned down at the far end of the roof now! Okay. We've reached the roof, Dizzy, we're coming! Ooh! Oh yeah, torque bow. Oh, I forgot I have a torque bow. I do tend to be a very reliant on one weapon. That's how I always play games. I find a weapon I like and I stick with it. Of those retro lancers are around. Incoming. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Let's go. Got them all. Nice. Okay, that's our guys. Hey, don't jump out in front of me. Make it, Marcus. All right. Okay, Griffin, we got your damn fuel. We're done. You're done? They're f dead. My people are all dead. We survived hammer strikes, the grubs, the whole damn war, and then you show up and I lose everybody. You fucking cod bastards. Everywhere you go, everything you do, it's always nothing but death, pain, and miseries. You piece of sh I just lost my f brother, all right? You hear that? My brother! You and your tower and all this fing emulsion can go to hell! We'll settle this shit another time, Phoenix. You can count on that. Mm. Are we gonna come to blows with that man at some point? Griffin? 
That's the California hello on, from Mr. Bean. To the truck. We've got a submarine to find. Wow. Marcus oh, Phoenix seems to be as persistent as his father, and just as predictable. If he lives, our entire species dies. Make sure that his touching little mission ends here. Yes. Yes. They talk. Is this the first time we've heard those monsters talk? Lucas! <laughs> Hit it, Dizzy! Chapter four. Here we go. Trinkers, turn in the guardhouse. Boomer. Oh, good lord. Oh, good lord. Try to take on. Got him. Gotta go get some ammo. Wow. Crazy stuff, guys. Let's go see if we can find some ammo boxes. Yep, over here. There we go. Now we got some more ammo. Oh my gosh! He had a really good aim. Kill my guys. I hear you. Get up.
where is he coming from? Oh, they got him. Right. That's nice job. Okay, guys. Sorry, I'm a little quieter right now. It's just been it's been really fun to follow along with this. Um, I find with this game, I get lost in it, and I don't, I don't mean in the in a bad way at all. Um, it's I really enjoy just playing the game, just sitting here and playing the game. Ink grenade. I'll have to check that one out. Not the current moment, but there's the boom shot. Maybe I do want to try it. I don't know. There's hammer burst. Hangar one. Sure, uh, search the shipyard for a submarine hangar. the hell like that one let's try the next hangar this submarine's something we can't miss right Diz? yeah you ain't gonna trip over it just keep looking what the hell's that white stuff everywhere spider webs never seen webs like that before it doesn't look like spiders to me oh i'm sure we'll find out what made them soon enough dizzy how are the five of us going to operate a submarine that's what I'm for, ma'am. Hmm. Yay, Dizzy. for the next hangar. It's like some sort of horrific version of uh, like a Men in Black. What am I supposed to do with that thing? I. This says shoot him in the butt, right? Yeah. Okay. They're just coming for Oh, more. All right. I'll tip it down the size. Wow. I wonder what other surprises the locusts have waiting for us. Those centipede things were crazy. We have uh, ammo in here. Something. The Retro Lancer. Oh, here we go. Got 
Guys, I want to see. Um, this may not be everybody's cup of tea, but for me, I uh, would actually very much like to see if there is a way Click to zoom. That's legacy. What's alternate? I guess I don't know. I'm just curious. Melee of a okay, I'm just trying to see if there's any way to customize the controls. Um that changes that. Um Yeah, not much. I was just wondering if I could change it so I could click in the uh, the right the left stick to make him run. I'm just so used to that in other games, and I've never implemented that with this one. But I was just curious if that was an option. Okay, level five, chapter five. So, bon voyage. Hoffman was right. One submarine. Yeah, and she's still in one piece. Let's look her over. Man, is that it? I thought we had subs the length of a thrash ball field. But this is just what we need, sir. A small one's gonna be a lot easier to sneak into Azura. Mm. You see, size ain't everything. Don't you mind dizzy, none, sweetheart. Just gonna look you over and uh, see what kind of shape you're in. Didn't special ops use these in the pendulum wars? Yeah, I know, but she's real handy for the job. <sighs> Marcus, this lady's gonna need some parts. See this rotor? Crack clean through. And then there's the fuel. She's empty. Okay, time to look for the goods then. So, what's first? Um, maintenance bay. Ooh. Okay, now find me a rotor. You know what you're looking for, right? Yeah, big heavy round thing with fan blades. Are we all going together? Yeah, we are. I was kind of surprised we didn't split up two and two, like... Someone goes for fuel, someone goes for... The rotor, but I guess... Riches. It does take all of us. Got him. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. 
I wonder if when you play on a harder level, if your teammates are any less capable. Because they've been really awesome. Like, I will say, a lot of these action games will um, occasionally help you out. But it's really left up to you as a member of your crew to do the majority of the work. And uh, I will say, sometimes I can just hang back and they will uh, very adequately take on the enemies. Those old shells are going to be pretty unstable. Oh, shoot. Order up. I didn't even mean to do that. I was going to hide behind it. Need more ammo. Nice. Okay. Continuing on. What do we have? Do we have any ammo? Oh, look at that. A little something. Okay. Looks like Handles a nice place over. for a rotor. Let's try looking up top. Think anything any enemies are gonna come down there? Alright. Get the rotor and the fuel. This act will probably end with a boss fight and uh, getting out of here on the submarine. There's a long shot. Let's get the long shot. I have a feeling that's what. Oh, you know what? Torque bow. Oh, I love that thing. Is really cool. Uh oh, Spaghetti-O. Damn, here come those gas bags again. Will you just die? Ooh. Nice 
job, guys. Okay. I messed up my. Uh... Oh, bummer. Get that boomer with a torque bow. Nope, never mind. Do not mean it does that if you hold it too long. Come on, we gotta keep looking for that damn rotor. You know what we need to do is find a maintenance area. Well that looks promising. Yeah, if that's a maintenance bed, then they probably got our rotor. Okay. Oh yeah, maintenance bay. There might even be fuel in there. Probably not, but... Here we go. We need a big giant rotor. Man, these guys are hanging out in every corner of this world. Um, is there someone right there? Ooh, like I said, that thing is so cool. Listen to the music. Music is great. You have like this futuristic military game. Uh, oh, a boom shield? This will do. And you guys see a rotor laying around here? No? Okay. All That's right. That's good. Here we go. Fun. Okay. 
ammo. Ooh, Lancer. This will do. And there's more. Okay, he's done. Hey, that looks like you. Dizzy, I think we've got it. We're on our way back. Marcus, I have this filly running smooth as a fancy gold watch for you noted. All quiet on your end? Yeah, so far so good. Okay, let's grab it with the loader. You what? Use the loader. What's the loader? Is this something I get over here? Was there... There was something I used before in this game that was uh it was like some sort of like walking forklift thing and i have no what what's that is that it nope that's another boom shield maybe we just get rid of the boom shield Maybe you gotta get rid of the boom shield to do it. I don't know what to do. Use the loader to pick up the rotor. The loader and the rotor. Where is it? Oh, it's back here. I see it, I see it. Probably would have had to drop the shield. Anyway. I see it's a pressure plate. All right. Hopefully, this doesn't take too long to get back to Dizzy. We still gotta get fuel. Man, what an episode. Reavers, get the loader behind cover. Okay. Gotta move, guys. Gotta move. You're in my way. It, don't lose the rotor. It's our ticket out. I'm trying to, but I feel like my guys are all getting in the way. I can't move. How do I get out? There we go. Oh, good lord. Um. You're good to go. That worked. Oh. Let's get that door open. Wait, this thing doesn't fit through spaces, that's for sure. Uh, 
All right, on my way, people. Coming through. By the way, if you've been watching this video this whole time, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I play some Gears of War 3. It's been a real joy to, uh, to experience this game. I've enjoyed the series. I really have. You guys have heard me talk about that on the channel. Um, you know, oh gosh, this has had some really emotional story points in it. Um, but that said, as much as I've hated losing characters I love, this game, I feel like, has been far more impactful story-wise. Um, I very much have enjoyed it. And uh, if this is indeed the end of the main storyline, then this is seems to be a fitting in so far. All right, fine fuel. Let's do this. You go get the fuel while I dismantle this. Fuel. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Look sharp. We've got more grub. <laughs> Man, some of these guys are uh, fierce. Okay, thanks for letting me know. Nice. <laughs> nice. Come on, cut across it. He's gonna have to show his ugly mug here. Well, nothing worth salvaging from this rust bucket. Where do we look next? Let's head outside and find the docks. Okay. All right. Continuing on. Let me just make sure there's not uh, anything valuable up here. There's the pistol. More grenade. Well, we could use those frag grenades. I just like the frags. Sweet. Again, guys, I'm. Maybe I'm just aging. I'm that guy who can't, you know, try other flavors of ice cream because he's too old now. You know, those people. And just, I'll just stick with what I know. But I've always been the kind of person I find a weapon I like and I never experiment as much as I probably ought to. That said, I have preferred the Lancer. I do like the God! Lancer. Look at that something. Ah, oh, Lord of the Rings right there. It's empty. 
That's really kind of... I don't think I've actually said that yet, but that's kind of what this game reminds me of a little bit. It's like futuristic armies battling, like, you know, Sauron's forces. Like, if you were to take Sauron's forces and put, you know, guns in their hand. Here comes some more! Ooh. Got him. Oh, I love this thing. I wish you could have more torque bow ammo. Right there. Marcus, take a look at those canisters on the deck. Looks like a free fuel supply to me. Yeah. We can't just jump on board, Marcus. We need to use the brow. Come on, let's move it. It's empty. Okay, that's how we board it. Get the brow in position. What the hell's the brow? The ram. Move the ram. Well, then say that thing. Okay. Over there. Yep, there's the controls. Got it. That should bring, yep, the steps over. Whew, and we'll go get some gas. So many of them. Beat the remaining enemies. Whoa! They just like blew up in the. Oh, 
Let's use the crane to get the fuel to the conveyor belt. I'll tell you what, when you are playing this game, that is the most satisfying noise when it goes down. You're like, oh, feels like I've completed something. I get just a moment of reprieve. Hammer of Dawn? That feels necessary. Uh, there we go. That was a close one. Now I do know I have the Hammer of Dawn. I just feel like I need to save it for something big. Oh, have. I almost said have mercy like I was Uncle Jesse. Why would I do that? Grew up on full house. Get up. All right, my turn. Fall away. Come on, tackle the meters running. I got my hammer of dawn. Um, gonna use that for. Whatever this is. And I should go pick up some ammo, though. Alright. Because I don't have much. And this feels like a good idea before it gets to be we get overrun. Yep. Oh, I love it. This will do. Torque bow again. But you know, the thing is, I got Hammer of Dawn. It's going to be all freshly loaded. I think you can use it twice. And it's very rare that you get it. All right, crane controls. Okay, sub uh, submersive hangar. Sam, you doing okay? No, I'm not, and neither are you. Yeah, that's about the size of it. But we'll keep going, right? For him. All right. That'll get us to his room.
Looks like the hangar's pulley system runs out to the dock. Dizzy, you operate the hangar doors. We'll take care of any resistance along the way. What? If I stay near here, I'll uh, be doing all right with ammo. Okay, we're coming up to the second door. All right, let's see what's behind door number two. I'm guessing it's not going to be a wide assortment of cash and prizes. <laughs> okay, Diz, open the second set of doors. Heads up, we got Queen's guards in here with us. Yeah, over here, too. We need to clear them out before we can open the next door. This should be the last set of doors. Get ready to bring the sub through. I'm guessing the locals are gonna have big send on board. Get out of the way here and let this thing go by. What do we got? Yes, please. Sweet. Right in there. Wow, that was good. Let's go. A Vulcan, Vulcan ammo box. Okay. You gotta have two people for that. That's awesome, though. Okay. Oh, there's the one shot. Okay. Oh, that's one bad dude. Somebody upgraded. Here's that boss fight we were talking about. 
Try explosive! Hammer Dawn. He moves a lot. Uh, with powerful explosive weaponry in order to weaken them. This is where the torque bow would have been a better option. There. Oh, there's more. Torque bow! We'll take it. <gasps> Here comes some more. Oh, goodness. Someone shoot the tail, because he's coming after me. Oh, wow. Crazy. Oh, no. Okay, uh, sorry, I'm not saying much, guys, because I'm, uh, probably just trying to focus on this. There we go. Oh, that's my hammer at dawn. Everybody into the boat. Oh my gosh. Let's save that. Oh, look at that. There's the ammo right there. Sweet. Fortunately, it doesn't power up the hammer of dawn more, but... to take this. this will do. Oh, okay. So close, guys. So close. Use the valve control over here. Valve control.
All right, now we've got the uh, the submarine actually getting in the water. Anya to Cole, over. Cole here. Cole, oh. this is Anya. We've got the submarine running. A sub. <laughs> That's bad spirit kind of toy. But you got to see what we found, baby. Whoa. Cole, please. Anya, you don't sound right. You got trouble? We're heading for Azura now. They don't know yet, we'll do they? With you outside the About Dawn. Might take us some time. Oh, yeah. We'll be there with some backup, too. Watch your six, Cole. Anya out. Don't worry, Anya. I'll break it to them. No, you won't. I'll tell them. Those are his boys. They were the foursome. He needs to be the one to tell them. Here we go. Parrot's favorite kind of toy. Chapter 6. A watery grave. The following day. Okay, so they've taken a little bit of time to rest up in the submarine. Am I controlling this? Yes. Gonna be able to shoot. So I'm just controlling the gun, I'm not... Anybody know? No idea, but the grubs must have sunk it. Oh, this hey, is this nice. Is beautiful. But I've had my fill of ghost towns. Okay. We're close to Azura, so we'll hit the maelstrom soon. Everybody man the pods. Diz, take us in nice and easy. Yeah, I better start powering up the guns. They did a really good job on this game with changing up the levels so you never feel like you're just doing the same thing for too yeah. long. We did that to ourselves, too. Well, there's no point crying over what we could have done differently. Because we'll never know. Yeah. All right, guns are live! I hope we shoot each other. You know what? I've never used these machine guns before. Yeah, Ooh. we could probably do it with some practice. There you go. And it just charges right back up again. Okay, I'm powering down the guns. It's all quiet. No point wasting juice. <laughs> Marcus, Good point. I've seen a lot of explosives out here. Everyone keep their eyes open. We didn't come this far to get killed by our own damn minds. It's the first time we've ever been underwater. Hey, check this thing out. Looks like we got an escort. <laughs> so it's not an enemy, it's a friend. And he's brought some friends, too. Hi, guys. It's like pre predator, but they're like predator fish. Oh, never mind. Ah, these damn things are getting dangerous. Take them out. Oh gosh. Oh, we're taking our water. Look out! There's more of them. Yeah, I can see them. You keep shooting. I'll get us out of here. They're dead ahead. I'm taking her down. I gotta get those things off our hands. <laughs> Little fishy bits. Yo, Dizzy, how deep can this thing go? Son, that ain't gonna matter if those crazy fish bust a hole in us. Look out! They're attacking from above! They're not smart. Ooh! They come from out of nowhere. Dizzy, kill the lights and get us out of here! 
Kind of hard to see. Yeah. It's okay. I can pick out the real big stuff on the sonar. We have sonar. Anything trailing us now? Nothing on sonar. Dizzy, how's the sub holding up? Nothing's busted yet, ma'am. We're okay. Everybody, quiet. Star Wars Phantom Menace stuff right here. <laughs> now where to go? It was right there. So cool. I don't see it. Ooh. There it is. Can we shoot it? It doesn't have highlight red, so. Come on, we gotta shake that thing. Okay. They're shooting. Good. Hey, they nearly breached the hole. Keep it away from the sub. Shoot it in the face. In the face. God, help. We got the whole damn Navy down here. It's not going to give up easily. Hey, look out for the mine. Come on, hold it on. Shoot it. That's why I'm Was aimed in the wrong direction and uh, I was shooting mines but I I, I did it from uh, the wrong the wrong spot hopefully I don't have to start that whole level over again oh shoot Well, yeah, it's hard to get them all. Try for those arches. We won't be able to follow us through there. Okay. Better hope it ain't a dead end. We just need to hold it off while we work Ooh. out how to kill it. Right in the mouth. Head for its mouth. Shoot it. This fellow ain't your son of it. Oh, it's not going to give up, is it? Kill it. Aim for the mouth. Give it all you got. Okay. Wow. We can't outrun it, Marcus. <laughs> it's stuck. Look at it. See ya. Woo. Oh. We made it. I'm getting too old for this. Oh man. 
Oh boy. Oh. Really tell. Oh man, guys, I'm I'm a. Uh, oh, okay. There's the debris. Oh, okay, Marcus. I think we're through. Nice job, Dizzy. Ooh. Thanks. I'm glad that's over. Yeah, we got a surface yet. Okay. Wow, that was really something else. Stay by. I see something. Torpedoes incoming! Fire! Whatever they can This is very arcadish. Torpedo to the clock! Dizzy! Get his angle on! I'm trying, son! I can't see him till they launch! Incoming fire clock! They must be real! Here we go. Man, this is crazy, guys. I like this a lot. Okay, I got it. Oh, shoot. They're coming from that angle. Okay. Wow. That reminds me of those arcade games when you gotta. You have like the shaky gun and you gotta shoot the stuff coming at you. Now that looks like the front door. We're gonna have to knock hard then. Come on, blast those doors open. Okay. I wonder if we're going to have a final boss fight in, from here. Like in the submarine to finish out the um, act four. Keep an eye out. There'll be more defenses. Get ready to take them out. Okay. Okay, everybody concentrate real hard. Because I ain't got much room in here to dodge torpedoes. True. Fire! We're at, at Azora now. Yeah, Marcus, your dad's gonna be real happy to see you. Real happy. Is that how this act is gonna end? Yeah. We're gonna see his dad. If he's still alive. Whoa. Okay. Nope. I think we just. 
Okay, Dizzy. Take her up. All right. I think I'm not going to watch the cinematic. I'm going to save that for next time. But guys, we just completed Act 4. Now, if we continue to play at this rate, um, there's six acts all together. So we could just do like an act per episode and uh, only have a couple episodes left of what really has already been my favorite Gears of War game so far. Um, as a whole, I think I even... I'm not sure how the ending will be, but... Um, I gotta say, I mean, it all kind of depends on how they land the plane here, but I, I've got to say that so far this has definitely been my favorite one, and I feel like each game has gotten better, and I can't always say that about trilogies, but I thought that they have improved on the game and the story and the character development um, as you go along. I loved Gears of War 1, but I really think Gears of War 2 was better. And then I've enjoyed this even more than Gears of War 2. Um, I, I Personally, for me, I've just really enjoyed it. But um, really interesting level because, you know, now we're dealing with kind of a more solemn Marcus. He's living in the wake now of losing his brother, um, the one who's closest to him. And you can kind of see that through some of the really creative things that we saw in Act 4 with, like, the dust guys who were like blending in with the statues and everything the the, uh, the dust statues and um i mean that was creepy as i'll get out but it was done really well um re this level hit a nerve the way the last one did for me like seeing the children um left like that and um you know but but i mean i thought mechanically this game was really awesome you know and it was cool to be in that submarine uh, fighting that big giant fish. Um, so, I mean, again, I like the crew we're with. It sounds like we're going to get reunited with Cole and Baird soon. Um, they they said, you know, hey, stuff's going on here. We got some help. I'm curious what that means, like who their help is. Um, but they don't know yet. And, you know, they're going to have to find out about Dom. And it makes me wonder, what is Baird and Coltrane going to say when they find out that Dom's gone? Because as close as Dom is with Marcus, uh, I mean, you know, he had a brotherhood with those two guys, too. They've been through a lot together. Um, so, man, what a story this has been. And, and guys, it's been a real honor and, and privilege of mine to be able to play it on the channel and, uh, and share this with you guys. But um, that's the end of Act 4. And uh, in our next episode, we will move on and play Act 5. Well, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. And I am excited to play Act 5 coming up next because it sounds like this is where we are going to see Marcus's dad finally. And I'm curious to see what shape he's going to be in. Is he going to live through this game? Does he live through the series? Um, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I got to think that whatever this is, just based on what I've heard, that for the most part, this is going to be the end of Marcus's story arc. You know, he's lost his best friend. I don't know if there's much story to tell after this. Um, and I mean, I did notice as I was going through, going, oh, okay, I was looking at Gears of Four, uh, Gears of War Four and Five on um, on Game Pass. Like, okay, just make sure they're all there. And I did notice it looked like somebody else on the cover of Gears of War Four. So it does look like we may be following a different protagonist. And I'm okay with that, um, you know, because it's. I, I feel like a trilogy is a good way to tell a story with Marcus. So I'm excited to see where this is going to go. I hope you guys are too. Thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, do me a favor, again, drop a like on this video. Subscribe for more content. Hang out with us at Discord. And if you'd like to support what you see, and uh, this channel maybe means a lot to you. Maybe this channel, maybe you, you enjoy this channel to the point where you'd like to support it. Um, then you can do that by hopping on over to Patreon, which you can do by going to this link right here and uh, get your hands on all kinds of goodies too. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I can't wait to play Act 5 with you on the next episode of Gears of War 3. But until then, take it easy. Let's play easy mode, let's escape.